Why won't they say it? Why won't they say it? How can you fight a war when you're afraid to name the enemy? Imagine fighting World War II without saying, we, we want to destroy Nazism. You know? Instead of that, we say, we just want to capture Hitler and a few of his leaders. We'll kill them. But, uh, and, uh, and we don't hate the German people. We like the German people. They're OK. And indeed, moderate forms of Nazism are OK. It's just the extreme form that you know, we don't like. But we're not at war with even that. We're not at war with it. That's the equivalent. You, you know, project that on, on Japanese uh, imperialism on any form. You cannot fight a war like that. And indeed, I think, I think we're not. I, I think our war in Afghanistan was, was a pathetic example of a war. And, and indeed, I think we, we did not achieve any of our real targets other than doing away with the Taliban regime. You know, uh, we didn't get the major terrorists out of that war. And I think even the war in Iraq is going to come back to haunt us. Because we did, because we we fought what I consider a compassionate war, and I think it's a moral abomination. And going back to the uh, ambulance uh, question, it is a moral abomination for one marine to die because we would not kill civilians. One American to shed blood because we didn't let the helicopters fire from far enough because we weren't sure if it was a civilian target or not. One Marine to die because we wouldn't shoot at a mosque? Do you know what they did last week at a mosque, the three Shiite spiritual leaders? Well, one of them slaughtered the other two. They were butchered in a mosque, not just in a mosque, in the holiest mosque to the Shiite religion. There was blood shed on the floor. And we won't shoot at a mosque and a Marine dies? I mean, that to me is a moral atrocity of this administration. For what? What are we doing this for? To make the Arab street love us? You think they're going to love us because we only killed 1,000 civilians and not 2,000 civilians? Of course not. If anything, they lose respect for us because we don't fight a war the way wars are supposed to be fought. There's no such thing, by the way, as MSNBC and C-SPAN, all these, uh, not C-SPAN, as MSNBC and CNN and Fox <laughs> say, there's no such thing as the rules of law of war. War is the negation of rules. It is the, it is the, it is the reversion to pure brutality. There's no such thing as acting nice in a war. That's a complete denial of what war is about. War is about killing people. There's no way to kill them nicely. There's no way to execute a war with compassion. And when you do, you send, again, the wrong message to the rest of the world. You send the message of moral weakness and cowardice. And I think that we are going to suffer the consequences of sending such messages into the decades to come.